So where do VCONs come from? VCONs are created after conversations happened generally, and they can either be created by the systems that make the conversations, like asterisk or free switch, or they can be made after the fact using an API. What do you do when you have a VCON? Well, you can give it to our new framework called the Conserver. The Conserver accepts VCONs and puts them in one place and then processes them for redaction or analysis so that you know what you've got and where it is. And finally, the Conserver then takes these VCONs and puts them into other data sources in a controlled way. So when your customer says, I'd like you to forget me, the Conserver can go delete all that data. Want to learn more? Come visit us at vcon.dev.